Absolutely. Oil prices have continued to edge lower coming in. You know, this is the, going to be the fourth week that we'll be seeing oil prices uh, ending in the red. Brent crude is uh, below the $90 per barrel mark even today. And uh, obviously, rate hikes uh, that are ex uh, accelerating across uh, major central banks, risk of global economic recession, are the factors that are coming into play for uh, the crude oil prices. Moving on, gold, that has remained quite steady overnight when you look at it, despite the ra uh, rate hike headwinds that we saw coming in. As of now, it's set for a flat week coming in for the gold prices they are somewhere around the $1,675 per ounce moving on to the metal side uh, base metal side we have aluminium uh, which rose further given the stimulus measures and stronger demand coming in uh, from China's uh, construction sector that is a factor working out well for the aluminium prices moving on uh, copper that is set for a, uh, to end the week uh, lower as well this is going to be the third consecutive week that we're going to see copper ending lower as well as you know rising interest rates uh, across the globe would way overall on the industrial activities and that is a uh, that is what is building pressure on the copper prices and in terms of soft commodities uh, cotton we've seen cotton drop as cotton output is expected to rebound from last year's experiences of unseasonal rain uh, which could be affecting the uh, crop as well and that is why we're seeing a correction coming in cotton prices thanks much for joining in and giving us